And we are just moments away from the start of the third period. And they have dropped the puck here on the final frame. Ray Ferraro is back down at ice level. Ray, 40 minutes played so far. What's been your assessment of this tilt? Finland's fortunes in this game are going to rely almost entirely on whether they can get more pucks to the net. I mean, the fact that they're even in touch with this game is a bit of a surprise. They've really not generated much at all. Zellweger's got the puck in his own zone. Wright's got it along the wing. You'll need more than that to beat him. Taking a playbook out of the Ray Ferraro school of hockey here. Just be aggressive. Go on your goal. When you score, go get another one. You've got the other team down. Go get more. Because you make yourself feel better. You build your own confidence. And you put this thing on cruise control. Let's it go. And he gets in front of that. No, it's just going to cover up the puck here for a whistle. He makes a safe play and kills the play before any other damage can be done. We're still in the early stages of this period. Canada's got a three-goal lead. Team Canada's won the face-off deep in their own end. Was moving the puck through his own zone. And that's poked away. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Team Canada's looking to break out of their own end. Allen's been tripped up, and we got a penalty coming up here. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Can't make it work. And that's broken up. There's the whistle. Let's get the official decision. That's an easy one, James. That's a trip every time. chance to take a look at the team's power play unit key for any team on the power play is to get control of the puck first so we'll look at the face off and this power play at the very least has to generate a little momentum it's their first crack at it tonight and they'll be forced to tag up after that missed pass retrieves the puck trying to kick start this power play long reach breaks up the momentum from the left side he moves it up ahead Team Canada's got the puck. They're looking to make something happen through the neutral zone now. Gets a stick on it to make the save. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. Team Canada's gained possession along the boards. Through center. Canada's got it along the wall. Can't get it to go. Team Finland's got the puck shorthanded. Puts it on net, and he gets just enough of it to keep it out from the back of the net. Slides the puck over. Oh, a short save! The shooter's right in the guts of the ice, but the goalie squares up, spreads out, and makes the save. Del Mastro's going to play it against the half wall. And that goes off a of body. From the neutral zone now. Canada's got the puck in their own end. Moves it quickly over to Offman. A little burst of speed now as the puck's moved inside the offensive zone. Carries the puck up through center. And that pass doesn't go. Canada's got the puck behind the net. Hines has it in the defensive end. Dumps it into the O zone. Finland's got the puck along the wall. With some open space at center. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. There's a save. Gives him a whack, and the officials are going to call this one. Let's see what the official says here. I think you just get all consumed with the play here. You're hunting the puck down, and you don't even realize you're taking a slashing penalty.
Allen sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. They'll get a chance on the power play for the very first time. They spent some time this morning working on it. Wrist shot from the slot. Great stop by Milich. Milich is going to bounce on it, and he'll take the whistle. He's usually a pretty conservative goaltender anyway, and so the opportunity to kill the play, he's going to take it. Lambert's ready to take the draw here on this power play. Finland's got it in the offensive zone. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Finland's got it behind the net. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Shot! Stones him in front! Yeah, he flashes the leather there to make the stop on a really difficult chance. Pankiace gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. Nice job tying up his opponent. Canada's penalty killers get a hold of it. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Sends the cross-ice pass. Team Canada's defense has been exceptional. They've defended well, kept the front of the net clean, and whenever there's a rebound, they get it out of there fast. That pass doesn't go. Regains control here in the neutral zone. Gauthier's time is almost done. Finland's ready to go on the attack. The man advantage is over. And he stopped that one. Milch is going to slow things down and opts for the whistle. He's had a really good night. He's been on top of his game, and there's not been much that's given him trouble. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. Canada's on easy street right now. They lead it 3-0. Sends a pass over. And that's a smart heads-up play by Milch. Canada's been all over them. It's like they've got a page out of their playbook. Any play they make, they're in the right spot. It's intercepted and in their net. Officials are set. Players seem ready. We're ready to get this thing back underway. Takes a shot. Cut into the glove by Milich. Milich is going to slow things down and up for the whistle. Well, you got to kill the play eventually. That way everyone can get reorganized. Rice won it off the faceoff. Puck grab by Gunther. Canada's in on the offensive attack now. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Quick feed to right. Traversing! They work the puck into a scoring spot, get a pretty good chance on goal. They just can't find a way to finish it off. Wright's won the draw, and they'll look to set up. Here's a short pass to Offman. Moves the puck. What a steal in his own end. Receives the pass. And that's a great heads-up play in the offensive zone. Turned aside by Milich. as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Oh, it serves up a little too sweet with that save. Moves the puck along the half wall. Reaches out and uses the stick. Cannon is able to lock that one off as it hits the post and stays out. But they've got such a nice big lead, they didn't need it. Getting into the later stages of this period, Team Canada's got a 3-0 lead. They have been in control right from the start. Good job tangling up his opponent here. And he easily stops that one. Straight up the middle. Here they come. Hangs onto the puck. Picked up along the boards by Clark. Finland's got the puck. Kapanen's got it in the offensive zone. Can't connect on the pass. Takes the feed. Shot right in front. Turns it away. This is a quality chance that the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. 
Finland's got possession here in the offensive zone. You can really sense the nervous energy here from the home fans here with this pressure. And they go the other way as they clear the zone. Keane's got it against the boards. Finland's got a hold of it against the wall. Gaining momentum along the wing. From in close. Oh, the glove save. Where'd that come from? Obviously not a more dangerous place on the ice to shoot the puck than dead center. Shooter tries to go under the bar, and the goalie is better with the glove. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Made that stop, and it's kicked away. Couldn't catch up to that pass. Finland's looking to break out. With possession along the wall. Big save. Milch is on top of the puck, and that'll stop the play. Pretty conservative play here, James, as he covers it up to kill the play. Team Canada's got it in the defensive zone. Finland's got the puck along the boards. Nice poke check. Up the neutral zone now. Team Finland's got possession at center. Right side set up ahead into the middle of the ice. Puck picked up by Del Mastro. Grabs it in his own end. And the crowd's on their feet, saluting the team after a hard-fought effort this evening. The lead penalty coming up here. Looks like slashing is the call. And let's see what the call is. A lot of times a guy will get called for slashing because his stick breaks. When I played, it was wood. You couldn't break that thing if you tried. 